We're here at the Hawaii Dermatology Seminar where I'm talking with Dr. Nazanin Saidi of Philadelphia about uh, what's new in the treatment of hyperhidrosis. There are a lot of therapies, topical, oral drugs, varying degrees of heroic surgery, but what's really new? So what's really new is using a microwave device to treat hyperhidrosis. The microwave energy works by getting to the level of the sweat gland to destroy the sweat glands and this is a new and exciting treatment that patients typically need two treatments for but we think this is as close to a permanent solution that we can get to. What kind of results are you getting in clinical trials? Well the clinical trials um, the patients are having a 90 percent improvement uh, after long-term follow-up up to a year. And uh, what are the side effects that you look for? So common side effects are having swelling or redness and lumps that pretty much go away within a week or two. And um, where does it fit into your own clinical practice? It is This is an approved uh, device now. Yes, right? this is an af approved device now. Um, it fits in for patients who don't want to take the oral medications, don't want to continuously come in for botulinum toxin injections, and are really bothered by this and you know really affects their daily activities, their quality of life, and they want a more long-term solution.